there! This is Christina from Speak English with Christina, where you will learn American culture and business know how to become confident in English. And today, we have a very special video with Benny, who is one of the past students on the Master Real American English program. And I wanted to share his story with you because I am super proud of Benny and all of the students in the Master Real American English program, really. And I just wanted to share his story with you because it is so inspiring.、Uh, as you'll see in the video, he talks about you know, his hesitations. He wasn't sure if his level was good enough. He wasn't sure if he would have the time to do the program. But he, and he also talks about you know, his frustrations with English, you know, going into a meeting, knowing what he wanted to say, but not having the words, and then just leaving the meeting. You know, frustrated because he couldn't express his ideas. And he talks about how he changed all of that through the Master Real American English program. And I just wanted to share this with you because, you know, maybe you feel the same way as Benny. You know, you're hesitant about your level, about your availability,、uh, but you know that you need to do something. So, before, you know, without further ado, as we say in English, without any more waiting, I'm going to let you listen to Benny's story because I'm sure that you'll find a lot of inspiration.、Uh, you'll feel you know, proud of what Benny accomplished, and you can feel proud of what you can accomplish as well. But let's go ahead and listen to Benny's story. So, hello everyone. Today I'm here with Benny, who has just recently finished the Master Real American English program for three months. Benny, thank you so much for taking some time to share your experience with us. Really appreciate that. To start, maybe just to, give, just to give us a little bit of context, can you tell us a little bit about you, about where you live, and maybe why you wanted to improve your English?、Um, I'm Peruvian. I live in Panama City. I work for a company m a n u f a c t u r e Uh, products in the US.、Mm -hmm. So I have to constantly write emails or talk with my colleagues in the、mm -hmm. US. And we also buy and sell products from other parts of the world. So there are a lot of communications involved. Our manuals are in English.、Mm -hmm. uh, so for me, it's Very, very important to do it、uh, right and to, to speak with, to speak on right with people and feel comfortable every time I do it.、Mm, right, yeah, because it sounds like you, know, you use English pretty much every day in your work, is that correct?、Uh, yes, yes, every day. <laughs> okay, every right. Day. Every day, it, yeah. Even on weekends. <laughs> even on weekends, it never stops, right? Yeah. <laughs> right, sure. So,、um, so if you, you know, you've got that opportunity to use your English every day. So, what was it that you felt, you know, when you joined the program? Like, what was the feeling or the frustration or the block that you had? That made you decide to, to start Master Real American English? Okay, so I realized that it's not enough just hiding the closed captioning. Would you see videos on,、mm -hmm. internet, on internet? Or maybe I, I, I sometimes struggle trying to say what I have in my mind. Right. And so I want to. To one and for all master that. Yeah, yeah. yeah.、Uh, so I was、uh, in a meeting, and,、mm -hmm. and so the guy leading the meeting asked questions, and I already have my answer in my mind. Yeah. But I, I, I had, like, I struggled trying to do what I want to do.、Uh, uh, sorry. Mm -hmm. To say what I want、yep. to say, and I at the end、uh, say one or two words, and then and, and I、uh, got out of the meeting feeling frustrated not、mm. to share in that. Yeah. yeah. And 
um, yep. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. Like, like it's like you were in this these kinds of situations where it's like you understood what they said, you knew what you wanted to respond. Like you had even formulated it in your head, but then like it just didn't come out. Basically. Yes. I I, some, I remember feeling like ready. Yeah. Ready to say what I want to say. Yeah. And when I try to uh, say it out loud. My voice sounds weird and I feel shy mm. and so I think nobody understood me yeah. and I wanted to 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 take the bull from the horns, right? Yeah, right, and, yeah. Uh, and master that and feeling comfortable doing it. Okay, yeah, yeah. You're just like, okay, I have this problem. Like you said, take the bull by the horns, good expression there. And just really fix the, the the situation, yeah. And so, yeah. you know, so you know, you you that was when you started, or before you started the Master Real American English program. And after the three months in the program, like, what has changed for you in terms of you know speaking English and using English? So definitely feeling more comfortable talking to. Ex- to strange people or mm-hmm. people I never met before. Right. Pastor Fluency Club was very good at that. Mm, um, yeah, 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 yeah. And so I I feel that my ear my ear earring is more trained mm-hmm. to get new accents right. Mm. Yeah, because in the Fluency Club it's like you have people from like all over the world and you have to to get used to hearing their different accents and their different ways of, of speaking English. And, and I think that's, it's kind of like in the real world because, you know, you can work with native speakers or, you know, people of other nationalities and, you know, you have to learn to, to communicate with them. Yeah. Yes. Yes. It's, it's, um, what else? Uh, pronunciation mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I have to uh, speak in our uh, sessions mm-hmm. um, we have to uh, talk mo- more frequently mm-hmm, uh, yeah. finding new words also right yeah are you talking about the, um, um, the group coaching what sessions what else and I and I and I it, yeah, the group co- coaching mm. sessions, yeah. Okay, yeah. And the private sessions too, mm. right? Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm. Uh, now I even notice that uh, when I listen, uh, when I'm listening uh, a song in English, yeah, I understand more quickly the lyrics. Okay, good. Yeah. That wasn't like something I wanted to do, but <laughs> like, well, I that think... wasn't your main objective. But it's a nice, it's a yes, nice result. yes, yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. 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 And, and, I, think, and I finally said, hey, this works, right? This works. Yeah, right. You know, I'm kind of the same way. Like, like you know, I like to learn languages. But when I, whenever I'm listening to a song, it's just, if I can catch an expression, like, I'm like, hey, I got that. And then I like to sing it because I can, because I, I know what they're saying. And I get, yeah, very excited about that. So, okay. Fantastic. Fantastic. Now, before you, before you joined the program, if you can remember back three months ago, um, were there any kind of questions or hesitations that you had about the program? I think the, the big questions was, is my level on, of English enough mm-hmm. for joining the program and or feeling uh, comfortable and I'm going to really really use it mm. or is it is it going to be good for me if yeah. my if I feel my level of English is not good enough mm-hmm. and I think uh, I think that it doesn't matter <laughs> it doesn't matter at all um, you have to you have to you you have to uh, just do it Mm. sure you have to work uh, a lot 
do the homework or preparing yourself uh, before the uh, the sessions mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. everything. But that's 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 normal, right? Exactly. Yeah. You have exactly. To do it. it. It's, yeah. It's, I mean, it's like anything. It's like if you want to make a change or you want to make some sort of improvement, you can have all the motivation in the world, but if you don't do it, you know, not, nothing's going to change. And I, and I think, yeah, I think that that's maybe, I, I don't know. And you can tell me what you think as a, as a student, but you know, when we put the program together, we were like, what can we create that's going to give the students, you know, like lots of opportunities to practice, to prepare things, to do homework, so that, mm -hmm. you know, so that it's quite structured, in fact, um, and that you get enough different opportunities to uh, really focus on the things that you want to focus on or to come with your questions and that, and that kind of thing, yeah. Oh, yes, this, this like, uh, so the program have different parts. Elements, or, parts, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, that and you and you you feel that it's designed to face different kind of situations, mm. and all together is going to improve your your English, right? Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. Because so, yeah, because English is like it's a lot of things. It's grammar, it's vocabulary, it's pronunciation, it's communication skills. It's mm -hmm. and you got to kind of do all of it. So yeah, mm -hmm. right. And and. It's never going to end. You're, it's, it's not like uh, you are going to, or, or at least for me, mm -hmm. I know that I'm going to, I, I have to keep studying English and practicing yeah. uh, forever, right? Uh, yeah, exactly. It's not, it's not one of these things where it's like, okay, I'm finished. Yeah, you can yeah. always. I mean, and, and I mean, like even native speakers, they take training on like how to be good at presentations or how to be good at networking. So, and I mean, like it's just a never-ending cycle of learning. But that's why it, that's why it's fun. Yeah, um, yeah, that's why yeah. It's fun. <laughs> right. So, um, I guess one final question is, um, you know, like for. A student who is maybe looking at the program and, and maybe who has the same questions as you had, is there anything that you would say to that student to help them to make their decision? Uh, I think it's for everybody. Mm -hmm. I think um, I think that you have to work hard to to make it work. Yeah, right. Definitely. Uh, I think it's a very um, it's it's fun because uh, you meet people from uh, from around the world. Yeah. Uh, uh, you face different situations. Uh, you you can even find new friends. Mm -hmm. um, and and it's going to uh, help you in in different aspects of the of English, right? Mm -hmm, From mm -hmm. pronunciation, new words, expressions, idioms. Uh, but it's going to do it in like in real life. Yeah. It's, like, that, yeah. it's going to prepare you for real situations, right? Mm. Yeah, exactly. Cause it, yeah, because it's it's yeah, like it's it's I mean it's like real interactions, real situations and and things like that. So yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Okay, great. Well, uh, Vinny, I just want to again say congratulations for uh, finishing the program and thanks a lot <laughs> for um, sharing your experience with us. Anytime. So there you have it. That's Vinny's story. And the other students from the Master Real American English program, they all have similar stories. And when you join the program, you will have a story like this too about how much more confident you feel when you're speaking English, realizing that it's not as difficult as you maybe imagined it was, but that you can do it because we're all here supporting you and even to make the whole process, like Benny said, fun because you meet people from around the world. Now, if you're not sure if this program is for you, 
go ahead and fill out the complete the application form. You have until Tuesday, January 28th to fill out the application form. I'm going to have a look at it and, you know, choose the students who would be good for this program. And if I see your answer and I feel like honestly this is not the right program, it's okay. I've got lots of other programs that will help you to reach your objective no matter what your budget, your availability is, we will find a way to help you reach your goals in English, feel more confident about yourself and just feel proud of yourself for doing it. So go ahead, complete the application form. I'll put the link below this video and I'm really looking forward to contacting you and helping you finally feel confident when you're speaking English. All right, thanks a lot, and I will talk to you soon.